Kenny, that was a game you had to grow into in each half, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. And um, you know, out- outstanding effort, I thought, from the players with obviously the Barnsley result earlier and the fact that you know we're at Wembley next week, even psychologically, subconsciously, it could be a tough one with Shrewsbury throwing everything at us. I felt for 20, 25 minutes we weren't at the races and it was all them. Then we just made one or two tactical changes and got some uh, uh, a foothold in the game from there and um, def- I had to really defend well got some great blocks in uh, but always then looked like scoring goals and I'm pleased to say you know, the chances came uh, at, uh, at the right time for us uh, to get our noses in front and um, uh, get a very very hard earned win doesn't matter now, but how would you explain that first 20, 25 minutes? Then? I just think tactically they, they gave us problems with the, the system that they played 3-4-3, three, three. we couldn't really get hold of them there was um, not enough not enough support up front for, for, for Omar Bogle and, and we couldn't really hold the ball up uh, and uh, so it made it difficult you know it made one or two changes and and I felt that uh, Brett got a little bit closer to Bogle uh, um, Lowe came over onto his natural side which you know made a big difference and gave us a threat and, and then Tom just dropping a little bit deeper uh, gave us you know a physical presence in front of the back four that at times we needed as well. Ben Close opened it for you and he's in a rich vein of form at the moment. Yeah, it's good. He's, he's always um, been a consistent player and frustrating first half of the season, but Ben Thompson was outstanding. But, you know, fair, fair, to, fair play to Ben Close. He's a lot of ability, a terrific um, character and hunger and um, real, real good competitor and passer in the ball. And as you say, of late anyway, added some goals now to his game and uh, that's great to see because that puts him on five. If you were an opposing manager today, would you have questioned if foul was that belt built up? The um, yeah, there was there was um, many many decisions and many many free kicks today, you know, and, and it's very difficult for the referee on a you know a, a, a bobbly pitch where the game had had no real flow. It was end to end. There was a lot of chances in the game, and it's very difficult for the referee to get every single one right or or to be uh, let's say consistent. Somebody's going to be upset, you know, and we can we can look at many decisions that we had uh, during the course of that game and say we were disappointed. You have to compete. Uh, you have to uh, do do your best and do everything that you can, and then after that, you have to accept the referee's decision. Second goal was clinical because you capitalised on their mistake. Yeah, and a very good goal as well. Um, pleased for Brett. I thought he played very well, particularly in the second half. A storming second half that, that he had, and as I said, just tactically, it, it uh, helped us to. Uh, just swap those guys over and find a little bit more space and a very good reverse ball from Hawkins as well. Yeah, you brought on Hawkins. What did he give you that Bogle didn't? Well, I felt we needed to hold the ball up today. You know, we, we couldn't get out. I, for, for the first half, I was thinking that uh, Omar might be able to get in behind them with his pace. And sometimes that's the case, but it didn't really work out. It was a frustrating day for Omar, but but uh, Ollie's a different type of player, and and uh, for us to get out on a on a pitch like that, it, it was it was difficult. And you know his hold up play is excellent and outstanding, and we needed that in the second half when um, you know we were under pressure. And you'll be pleased you saw the game out comfortably. Yeah, it was never necessarily comfortable. You know, Shrewsbury are battling for their lives, and you know see the game earlier. We watched the game earlier at. Um, at, at Walsall, you know, it's hard for Barnsley, but you know you have to find a way to win. We did today, outstanding clean sheet and some good goals. And as I said, you know, after the first 20, 25 minutes, I was very pleased with, you know, the the first the defending and then the chances that we created on the on the break and the counter attack. Where playing three at the back, there were spaces.